Hello everyone, I am Shyam Pasari and welcome to ASN Academy. In this video, we will discuss what is the quadrilateral, what are the basic properties of quadrilateral and what are the seven different quadrilaterals. So without wasting any further time, let's begin with our topic. So let's discuss our first topic that is what is a quadrilateral. The definition of a quadrilateral is as follows. A closed plane figure bounded by four line segments is called a quadrilateral. In simple terms, you can say that quadrilateral is a polygon of four sides. Now polygons are plane figure which are bounded by all sides. So by the definition of the quadrilateral, we can say that a quadrilateral is formed by four sides AD, DC, BC and AB and we can clearly see that it has four angles, angle A, angle B, angle C and angle D. Now since it is a polygon then the sum of angles of a polygon has a formula of 2n minus 4 into 90. On putting n equal to 4 we will get 8 minus 4 into 90. Upon calculating you will get the final answer as 360 degrees. So I can say that the sum of angles of a quadrilateral is equal to 360 degrees. Diagonals are basically straight lines which joins the opposite vertices in a polygon. So over here we have two diagonals that are AC and BD. Now these are the only two diagonals that are possible for a quadrilateral. You can name the diagonals as AC or CA or BD or DB both are same. So giving you a quick summary about the quadrilateral, we can say that a quadrilateral has four sides, four angles and the sum of angles is equal to 360 degrees and it has two diagonals as well. The sum of the sides of the quadrilateral is equal to the perimeter. So if I name AD as A, DC as B, BC as C and AB as D then the perimeter of a quadrilateral is equal to A plus B plus C plus D. The area of a quadrilateral is equal to base into height of the quadrilateral. For this quadrilateral we have BC as the base of the quadrilateral and the height of the quadrilateral will be the length of the perpendicular drawn from the top vertex to the base of the quadrilateral. Our next topic is types of quadrilateral. Now we have seven different types of quadrilateral which are a trapezoid, rectangle, isosceles trapezoid, square, rhombus, a parallelogram and a kite. Except for the last quadrilateral that is a kite, all the other six quadrilaterals are very important because all the questions in the exam are generally based on these six quadrilaterals. A trapezoid is more commonly known as a trapezium. As you can see from the shapes of the quadrilateral, all the quadrilaterals are very different from each other in the properties as well. So I will make separate videos on each different quadrilateral so that you will have a very clear understanding on each kind of quadrilateral. That was all for this video and I hope that you understood what is a quadrilateral and the basic properties of a quadrilateral. In this video, I have only discussed what are the seven types of quadrilateral and I have not discussed the separate properties. Because if I would have discussed all the separate properties, then this video would have become too long. So I will make separate videos on each kind of quadrilateral discussing the separate properties. And if you have any doubt from this video, then you can post your doubt down in the comment section or you can send your doubts to us to our channel's official Instagram or Facebook page and we will surely solve your doubts as soon as possible. I have also provided the link to the official website of Asian Academy down in the description. So you can go check that out too and if you did like the video then please hit the like button and subscribe to the channel ASIN Academy.